Hi guys, and welcome back to another episode of Cloudpunk. This is part two of our series. We are back. Um, we did our first initial quests. We went to the scanner last time, um, and we got our, I guess, our ID cleared or whatever. Um, and now we are supposed to go back to Cambria Heights to pick up a package. So let's see. Um, uh, there is our vehicle. Our beautiful piece of crap. Let's get in. Alright, let's see. Um, so... I'm trying to remember, did I clear this whole... I think I cleared this whole place, right? Well, maybe not everything, but it seems... Julia... Julia Navago. Did I talk to that per... No, I don't know. Let's continue with the story and we'll uh, see. <laughs> We might come back later. Um, let's get in our car. I love this uh, this view. I don't remember how you can... Oh, it's X. Okay, so pressing X locks your screen or gives you the freedom to look around, which I love a bit more. Adds to the immersion of uh, driving uh, and not paying any attention. <laughs> and I guess those are like the cops or whatever? Not sure. I saw them fly by with the sirens. I think last, uh, last episode. So let's see... Oh, there's also an area over... Man, this map is huge, by the way. Can I like... I can open a map. Hold on. Avalon Heights. Gallows Row. Okay, so... We do have new areas. I'm not sure if I can actually like swap between them. I guess not. I guess we only see the map of the current area we're in. It's fairly really big though, that's quite nice, that's quite nice. Um, okay, here we go. Uh, so we need to go down here. How do I go down again? Is it, is it C? Is it shift? It's shift. Can I... Oh, there we go. <laughs> it's a bit harder to do uh, in first person. And we got another dealer here as well. Let's talk. You from the east, lady? You're good, but no corpse sack. Got it. No corpse sack. No. I mean, should I buy one of these things? Maybe I should. I bought it. And can I? <gasps> what does Thanks. it do, though? You folks from the east are good with me, but no sack. What does it do? I have no clue what that does, so <laughs> I'm not seeing any different. Uh... Oh wait, I am seeing. I am tripping. <laughs> okay, so this is definitely something. Um, what's this? Yeah, I got another punch card as well. Okay, so we are like not doing so great. <laughs> Let's say package. Control, we package. I'm at the destination and no one is here. Control. Camus, are you awake? Yes, I am awake. Excited. Oh, what Camus. Hell? Can you it's scan cute. the area? Local scan. Look for ID chips on possible delivery containers. I don't know how. Wait. I know how. I think. What is box? <laughs> a box is a square cube. No. What is that box? It's right there. Okay, I see it. Oh, okay, okay, I guess okay. that's the package then. Why is no one here? I have Wait, there's also feelings. something. Me too, Camus. Hmm. There's also something over here. Ah, yeah, I missed this. Some electronics. Nice. Okay. Um. So I guess the package is this box over here. Yes. Strange though. This guy looks uh, sketchy. <laughs> and I mean, you gotta appreciate like the environment. Oh, look at this. Look at this. Look at this. I love this. I love this. It is a bit loud sometimes with the screeching of the, the vehicles, but... Oh, wait. There's something over here. And... Memory chip. Nice. Okay. 
So we got the box. Um, okay. Wait, do I have a, do I have a rear view? I hear noise. noise? What noise, Camus? Tick tock, tick tock, tick tock. From the package. I hear it too. Is it a bomb? I still have bad feelings. One second, Camus. Control, come in. Control, this is driver 14 FC. Come in. This is important. Driver 14 FC, this is Control. Please deliver your current package with urgency. Control, why is this package ticking? I don't think she should have to do that. No, Wait, what? Tell her. Control, what's happening there? Uh, nothing. I've been informed that you're to stop calling us about the package. Deliver it quickly. That is all, please. No more communication until delivery. Camus, I don't know what to do. I am nervous. Why? I am nervous because you are nervous. Maybe we I can mean... throw away the TikTok. TikTok, 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 TikTok. Maybe I could dump it at the trash chute in Section 8B. That sends it into the refuse collection at the base of the city. Nothing ever comes back from there. Will Mr. Control be mad? Yes, but I get a bad feeling too, Camus. I think it will be bad either um, way. I want to help. Oh no, we gotta choose. Don't know what to do. I know, Camus. I know. I just have to make a call on this one. The metro hub or the trash chute, and it's sticking. Oh my God! Okay, it's sticking. It's sticking. It's probably a bomb, right? That has to be a bomb. There's no other way, right? Package that's sticking. I'm gonna deliver a bomb now to a metro hub. No, I'm going to uh, to the trash chute. I won't bring it to the metro hub. I think I'm gonna bomb some people. Let's not do that. Um. Yeah. So let's follow the main road here because it go because it goes quicker, and then we will take a right turn. I do love the lights and everything though. I say while carrying a bomb in my vehicle. <laughs> um, yeah, okay. Come on. Is there like a time limit? I hope there's not because I'm not really going that quick. Let's turn here. And let's go straight. Okay, 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 okay. We got some time. I hope this doesn't change like anything major in the story. I really hope I'll be fine. Oops, I crashed into someone. Alright. So what do I do? Control told me there are only two rules, and I think we already broke them both, Camus. Mm. I guess we just tell Control we lost it? I am frightened. Don't worry, we'll be fine. Maybe I won't even be fired. Really? I doubt it. Yeah, let's uh, stay clear of that area now. Driver 14 FC, this yeah, is going to fire me. Is there anything you want to tell me about that last job? No, nothing. All right. Well, I'm just glad it went okay. For your next delivery. Are we just gonna forget about that? Nav point to collect a package at Life Corp Industries. You'll need to find a way up to the roof of the building. Our client didn't leave us an access code, but um, well, you're a smart <laughs> kid. You'll think of something. Are we just gonna okay. ignore the fact that I just dropped a bomb in a trash chute? Ooh, a metro. Oh boy, this can't be good, right? That's gonna have. Uh, this is gonna have repercussions, definitely. Ah, gas! I need gas. How do I do this? Oh, oh, oh my god. I'm completely destroying my car, I think. Ah, oh, it drains my money, of course. I mean, that's pretty expensive. That's pretty expensive, holy shit, okay. Uh, so let's let's leave the main road here and go. Can I go at home? No, no, I can't. 
This is the height limit. So let's go down and then underneath, I guess. Wait, I can't go underneath? Oh, no, I can't. Okay, so I have to go around. Hmm. All right, then. And look at this. It's pretty creepy, though. I think... Oh, my God, there's a window there. Yeah, that would kill me in real life. I am afraid of heights. That would completely destroy me. Like, actually... Oh, my God, yeah. Uh, um, I'm just glad there's like clouds and I don't that I can't actually see the ground. Oh, I need to go over here. Let's go down and park her up. There we go. All right. Uh, woo, nice glasses. Okay. Are we not in the same place we were before with the? I think we are actually. Hmm. How do we get up here? Life Corp employee. I'm here to collect. Sign here, please. You'll find the package on the roof through the hotel entry to your right. The access code is B965E. And don't talk to the package. Don't what? You'll see what I mean. It don't won't shut up. Talk to it's the package. To Avalon Heights. They're expecting you. Don't talk to the package. What the fuck is in the package? Avon? Who's Avon? Driver 14FC, this is an automated message to inform you that you have received your first and final warning for a delivery violation, misdemeanor number 001. Failure to deliver to recipient through gross negligence and or crisis of conscience. Further infractions will result in termination of your employment with Cloudpunk. Please note that if your contract is terminated, remote access to your HAVA will be severed at the point of termination, and you will be liable for any loss or damage to you, your body, or any other third parties if you make an unscheduled, uncontrolled landing due to sudden loss of vehicle control. Please reply with yes if you understand. Yes. Audio confirmation of infraction report received. You have been warned. Doesn't control have anything to say about this? Control is currently unavailable. What in the world, okay? Your face looks familiar. Do you need some stems? Uh, do I? I, don't, I think Thanks. I've had enough. Um, oh, wait, I can sell some again. stuff. Wait, so Julia. Talk to me. Why are you so small? Your face looks familiar. Am I so? Do no, she's actually stems? small. Look. Uh, yeah, let's sell our... Not my flute, uh, not my flyer. Wait, what flyer? Can I not sell this? Okay. Uh, let's sell this and let's sell this. Yeah. Thank you very Thanks. much. See you again. Soon. Yeah, sure. Okay. Um, ba -ba 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 -ba. How do I get up there again? Was it through this elevator or was it. No, it's closed for me. Let's go back and... Ah, the elevator is right next to him, probably. Like, right here. Yeah. Alright. There we go. Is the big guy still here? No, he's not. Uh, B... 9... 6... 5... E. Nice. Ah, oh, here's the big guy. Pick up box. Don't let it be up. There's a guy in the box. <laughs> ah, balls. Ah, balls. Coolant. Ah, I can buy that from uh, Julia. Wait, let me actually let me actually do that. Where is she? She's gonna be there, right? No, maybe yes, maybe no. Yes, she is. Let's buy some coolant from her. Well, she wasn't lying uh, when she said, see you uh, soon. Your face looks familiar. Yeah, I'm pretty Do close. You need some um, coolant. Thanks. Thank you. Let me go, please. See you again. Let me go. Soon. <laughs> I'm being held captive. Oh, there we go. 
So we can fix the elevator. So that's why we need some of these items probably. So I shouldn't actually sell all of them. But that's good to know. That's good to know. That's actually really good to know. Of course, I've been selling everything that I found. I hope, I hope I won't be needing something like really importantly. Oh. Uh huh. Look at this. We can go higher now. I mean, does nobody like need this elevator? Aren't they like all stuck up here if they don't use it? Okay. Hmm. We're gonna look at this. Look at the style of the game, man. The developer really put some effort into this to really give you the whole experience of like a cyberpunk voxel based uh, environment. Nestor Ooh. Cray is wishing you a good day, stranger. Normally I don't sell to your kind, but business is hard these days. Nice voice. Um, 4,900? That'll be all. No, thank you. Nestor Cray will never remember the kind stranger. Will never remember the kind stranger. Okay. Hey, lady, you should try our noodles. We fried them with the chili out like they do out east. Why do you think I'd want that? Because you ain't from around here. Am I right? Do That's I true. stand out that much? Sure, but you're talking to a guy with half a metal face. I don't exactly blend in here either. In Novalis you do. I see lots of people with augments. These aren't augments, lady. I was in the war. That's where I learned to cook. Well, I don't like chili oil in my ramen. How about gyoza? Stop pushing me. <laughs> gyoza is a different story. You got any? We did. But now I can't justify making more than two or three dishes. No one comes by here no more. How come? See that elevator over there? It went nuts, and now it won't carry people up to the transit station. I fixed that, thank this you. This was the main route to catch the train. Without the elevator, no one walks by. The elevator went nuts? Yeah, it sure did. I tried to talk sense into it, but it says it will only talk to an automata. The damn thing told me humans are only Wait, good for eating. Maybe I could talk to it. It don't talk to people. I have an automata. Maybe he can help. Knock yourself out, lady. But can I get some of those uh, noodles? No, I guess not. Okay. Um. Wait, so like which elevator? The one that I fixed? Or is it another one? And I'm going here because there is something over here. Uh, yes, this. The fisherman? What? Popular magazine in the marrow. This says they used to catch giant glowing green fish in the bay before Corpsex started charging a thousand limbs for a permit. Alright. Giant green fish. So I guess this is a. Wait. Talk to an elevator. Wait, what? Where is it? Where is the elevator? Am I like... Ah, wait, no, wait, look. Ah, no, okay, this is the side quest. Blue icon is the side quest. Alright, I got it. I got... No, it's another... I thought I was like in the same area, but... No. Uh, where is the elevator? Here it is. Are you the elevator that eats people? I am Gorgothra, Holy shit. child of Kara, and Kora destroyer again. of worlds. Hear my roar and quake in fear, for I will consume all mankind. Uh-huh. Listen, Gorgothoa, my friend Joe isn't getting any business because people can't use you as an elevator anymore. Any chance you could go back to just moving people up and down? The destruction of mankind is my goal. Oh, Nothing shit. less will satiate my hunger. I will speak no further with your kind. I consume humans. I do not converse with them. 
Camus, come in. Are you getting all this? Can you talk to Gorgothoa, please? Hello, Mr. Gorgothoa. I am Camus, <laughs> an automata just like you. You are nothing like me. I consume the souls of humans. You serve them. How do you consume them? Within my belly, I swallow them all. But then, where do they go? What do you mean? They just get out again, but on a different floor. That is what the humans want. So you are serving them too. Nonsense! <laughs> I excrete only the waste. But you are not working now. I mean, you are not eating them. I grow weary of their flavor. We need to convince him that he's not really eating the people. No, I have another idea. Gorgothua, what do humans eat? I do not understand. Well, you need to eat humans to survive, and they need to eat to survive too. Have you tried ramen? Why would I waste my time with human food? Well, you're broken right now. I mean, you're not eating humans anymore. They taste bad, right? What if you ate some ramen with them? Perhaps. <laughs> no what if every human <laughs> came with a side order of ramen? A delicious noodle side dish. What if I tire of ramen? Then there is always gyoza. Very well. If humans come to me with ramen, I will take them up to... Uh, I mean, I will willingly consume them. <laughs> Thanks, Gorgothua. <laughs> oh, no way. I need to get them ramen. <laughs> what am I doing? I'm, <laughs> I'm taking ramen to an elevator. What in the world is going on right now? <laughs> I can't believe this. But okay. I actually wanted to buy the ramen, but yeah, that's fine. Joe Ham. I have some very good, very weird news for you. Yes, exactly. The elevator working again? Yes, but only for people carrying a bowl of ramen. That's... that's amazing! I can put up signs. Free elevator ride with every bowl. Don't thank me. Thank my automata, Camus. Hey, thanks to the both of yous. I'm gonna whip up a batch of gyoza as a thank you. Oh, Come yeah. back next week or any week after and you don't next gotta pay week? me nothing for your dumplings. Perfect. Can I... Hey, Uranya. Want something to eat? Okay, so there really isn't... You know what? Let's eat something. Thanks, Joe. Let's eat something. Yeah, whoops. Come by next week for fresh dumplings. You don't gotta pay me nothing. Oh, uh, you instantly eat them. Okay, okay. I see. Um, yes. So... We did fix the elevator. Did I talk to this person already? Have you seen my little one? She must be here somewhere. Little one? My white snapper, my little mouse. Have you seen her? No. Um, no, sorry. Little mouse. I mean, we could have a look. I don't think I explored the whole area over here. We also had this uh, barrier here that I can probably walk through. I cannot. Okay, nice. That's fine. That is fine. Um, oh, this is cleared. Does that mean that I can now use the elevator or does that mean that I still cannot? That is the question. Use battery, okay. What? Your journey ends here? Okay, I guess. My journey ends here. So, let's see, maybe I can use the elevator now. Ah, yes. Gorgontoa will consume you now. <laughs> uh, ah, we're back down now, I see. 
I guess is it the same area, right? Yeah, yeah. Alright, so let's jump back into our vehicle and get out of here. Wait a minute, this is Cloudpunk. Oh, wait, we're at Cloudpunk. Gang member. Hey, come here a minute. Why? We want to talk to you. So talk. What do you do? Delivery driver. You're cloud punk, right? So you must be thinking you're pretty badass. If you say so. Why you be nice to her? She delivers to the spire. She don't respect us. Show me something to respect then. You're sassy. Acting like you weren't afraid of us. I ain't. She don't know who she's talking to, Razor. She don't know how you got that name. Razor, are you a shaving robot? You don't gotta take that from her type, Razor. You gotta do something. Nah, I like her. She's got a big mouth like me. So you're both part of Block 4-0, right? You heard of us. I heard there's an android gang I should avoid. That's good advice. You don't want to get in our way. Why do you get such a bad reputation? We do a lot of things we ain't supposed to. Robbing people? Nah, much worse. Urban renewal, bitch! Oh, yeah! Wait, what? <laughs> Urban renewal? <laughs> yeah, community projects. Planting gardens on corporate waste ground. Turning old factories into playgrounds. Real hardcore shit. <laughs> I mean, no, I don't get it at all. There ain't nothing in the Volus that will get you in more trouble than fucking with corporate property. We would be safer if we were straight murdering fools. Well, good luck, I guess. <laughs> that sounds like a worthwhile thing for a gang Planting to do. Gardens. I just figured gangs in Navalis were a bit more... You assumed wrong, but that's alright. We ain't surprised they talk shit about us. Well, I won't. I hope you two never get caught. Fuck yeah! You was right, Razor. She's all right. You stay loose, Cloudpunk. We we'll see you later. Why did they always... Ah, there were two of them. They were just standing inside of each other. Okay, makes sense. <laughs> no, but... Um, they always run into me after they're done talking for some reason. It's like they're... Like I'm turning into some kind of magnet. Oh, let's collect that as well. Uh, we don't need food. I need my car, and I think it's up there, I guess. Yes, okay, that is already parked. I didn't know, was it close to Cloudpunk? So, let me see. I'm in... What am I now? Lower Midtown? Upper Midtown? Um, I have no clue where I am. Let's go to our package. Well, to our Hello. delivery location. Can you hear me? I can hear you, Box. How are you today? Oh, no. Camus, we're not supposed to talk to the Box. I completely understand. Uh, uh... Are you an android too, Camus? Fine. You can answer him, Camus. I am an automata. I am a dog. Or a car. I am a dog car. How strange. <laughs> hey, fella. You're a box. I am in a box. My name is William. What are you if you're not a box? I told you, I am William. But what are you? I was a sous chef in Little China. But not anymore. I'm moving up in the world. In a way, that makes me sad too. How come? Because I won't be able to talk to little people like you anymore. That will be a shame. But it will all be worth it. Avalon Heights. I can't wait. What will you do up there? I don't know. I don't know yet. Avalon Heights. It's exciting. Maybe I'll be working as a personal assistant to some pop star. Or maybe even a CEO. Perhaps I'll nice. be an executive at one of those big corps. Hiring and firing. I would love to fire a human one day. Oh, no <laughs> offense, driver. Nice. None taken. What's it like being a driver? I love to hear about poor people. Now that I will be rich, fuck? I might even be an organizer for charity dinners. You won't be invited, of course. 
But I would talk about you. Thanks. Nice, and I've thank only you been very a driver much. for a little while. I was a musician. Perhaps I should be a musician. Of course, I would be too rich and too busy to learn to play. But I might get some augments so that I can perform. Maybe the saxophone. Uh huh. Rania lost her home and we were evicted, Box. I mean, William. We had to move to the city. Oh, why? Debt corpse. Oh, yes. They can't be very unpleasant. I have heard. She had to sell my body for money, too. A circumstance oh, with which that's I sad. am familiar. I sold my body also. You see, a chef's android body is worth a lot these days. My body was the only part of me worth anything. Now I'm just a head and a dream. Can we open the box to see him? I want to see the head. No, we're not allowed to open the packages. We're not supposed to speak to them either. I am sad. You'll get over it. <laughs> yes, doggy. Don't worry. One day you will have a lovely body like mine. What will your new body be like? Oh, I'm sure it will be something good. I traded my old body, my apartment, and all my savings for this place in the spire. Surely they have the best android frames there, too. Okay. So, if you catch that, by the way, so we had to sell our dog's body because of um, that corpse. That's pretty, pretty sad and pretty dark as well because that means we actually probably made like a copy of the persona or like the brain of our dog and then sold the old body. That's kind of dark, but okay. Let's continue. Maybe that's our goal, by the way, get enough money to buy a new, uh, a new body. What's this? Some more used batteries. Nice. Is this a dog? No, it's not. It's uh, <laughs> it's a. It looked like a dog from like behind. But, yeah. I mean, look! Wow! 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 Look at this. This reminds me of that scene in um, what was the movie called again? Blade Runner, where he went up to like the giant um, hologram lady. Love that movie. Ooh, look at that. Like the metros or the trams or trains or whatever. I have no clue where I'm going, by the way. Do I need to go up or should I go... I think I go over here. I don't think I need to go up even further. The Corpsec Flyer. They're trying to recruit for their informant program. Great text on a dark grey background. Inspiring. Whoa, it's... Whoa, it's just laggy for a bit. Strange. Love this environment. I keep saying it, even I keep saying it. Hello? Oh, it's this guy Do with we have the meat. A delivery? His name is William. I'm the supervisor for this shift. Domestic Android Supervisor Reginald Esquire Buckley Senior. You're a vacuum cleaner. <laughs> no, I am a refuse disposal officer with cleaning functions. The senior refuse disposal officer. And this is our new recruit. William, your head will be mounted on a Digit Lux cleaning unit 3000. And you will be working on the 3287th floor of Avalon Heights as the junior apprentice unit sorry william sorry for what i am to be the junior apprentice please pass me over to mr buckley i'm keen to get to work and you do understand that we can no longer be friends right i like you and your pet human but it just <laughs> wouldn't be the human. done thing to be seen with you 
Oh, I understand. I am happy for you. Goodbye, William. So, he is gonna be turned into a vacuum cleaner. Probably something like this. <laughs> Alright then. That seems fine. Uh, bus stop. Can we take a bus? No, we can't, right? Yeah, that's pretty much gonna be it. Goodbye, William. <laughs> Have a good life. Find a real Do you miss William? I do not. Do you miss William? Okay. Me neither. Well, we took William to his new home. I think we should go and check on ours. We have a home. Wait, we have Is a home? Is it big? Does it have a garden? Is it big? <laughs> do I have my own room? Sorry, Camus. It's not really a home. It's just a place where we can stay for a while. And it's all I can afford on a cloud punk salary. No pool. I want to see no our home. Butler. I'm not even sure we have running water. Maybe we can go somewhere nicer if Cloudpunk pays us lots. Camus, life is going to be hard here in Novalis. You need to prepare yourself for that. Even this place might be too expensive. We can't afford to mess up. Got it? Ooh, a One bad night and we could be evicted. Ah, it's an arcade. I understand. So don't get excited about this new place. It's not much. Okay, okay, I understand. I am still excited. Did I park over there? Yeah, okay, I parked over there, right. Come on, elevator, consume me. Is that a vertical elevator? Um, horizontal. Oh my god. Confusion is hitting me. I mean, this is an elevator, right? Or am I? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's going to another area over there. Come on, boop. Down and look beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Just looking at that, sorry, I couldn't say anything. You know, it's absolutely beautiful. And look at the city. Big props to the developer of this game, and I keep saying and big, big props. I love the style, the style, the music, the voice actors, everything. And chemists, our little android dog. Uh, but yeah, let's go to the house now. I want to see it. There's our car. I swear I parked it. Oh no, I didn't. Never mind. I'm stupid. Enter your apartment, oh my god, I love this. Let's go. Look at this place. It just makes me smile as well. Wow, wow, wow. Alright, let's go. Oh. Don't want to hit I, I'm wondering, I'm wondering, should I repair my vehicle somewhere? Because I saw the gas station, but I also saw a mechanic. Is that something that we should do? I honestly don't know. I should actually check because I don't want to like explode out of nowhere. If that even happens, uh, I'm not sure. See, this is a gas station, but I need a mech... Let's go like this. Oh wait, our apartment is to the left, uh, right here. Okay, let's go straight. I suppose I won't need to go up, but rather go down. Yeah. There we go. Um. Ooh. I mean, it's a nice area, not so busy. It looks kind of... Okay, it looks kind of sketchy with those buildings, but... Um, well, I mean, looks nice. Let's listen to this guy as well. What are you looking for? Whatever oh, it's it is, a I got merchant. It. Okay. A purse. Black sunglasses. No. I do get the occasional lag spikes, Thanks. so that's kind of interesting. Um, hey, come back anytime, lady. 
Evelyn. Do I know you? Do I know you? What? If I knew you, I might not know. Let me try this again. Why are you hanging around outside my apartment? Ah, uh, this is my are apartment. Are you with the Debt Corp? Or Corpsec? Are you spying on me? I am your neighbor. Shouldn't you be in your apartment then? I am waiting to talk with you. What do you want? I want to know if I know you. If we used to know each other. If we were friends. No, I just moved in. I've never met you before. Are you okay? No. You're an android, right? So did you have a firmware upgrade that went wrong or something? I hear those can cause androids to lose their memories, I think. No. Do you remember my friend, Dr. Dzizic? We live next door. No, I told you I just moved in. She is missing. I am alone. Look, I'm really busy. I just moved here and I barely have any money. I don't want money. Why would you say that? I didn't ask you for money. I'm sorry. I just don't know if I'm the best person to help you. I don't know anyone else. There's some homeless shelters for androids downtown. I have a home. What do you think I can do for you? There is a card. It was posted into your mail. I think it is for me. That's it? Just a card? Yes, I need it. It is how I will start to come back to me. So, excuse me. So we need to get that card, I guess. Oh, love this. Camus, can you read me? I'm in the apartment. You're authorized to access the systems in here. I am here. Can I see you? It is amazing. There's a oh, table and a balcony, and the roof perfectly fits on top of the walls. <laughs> yeah, it's all right, I guess. A bit sparse. I'd love to be able to decorate, you know, oh, nice. make it less clinical. Do you remember the birds we had back home? Yes, they landed on the window ledge. I could never Bunch catch guard. them. Yeah, not much chance of wildlife here. There Ooh. are rats. I detect almost 50 within the property. Ugh, do within me a favor, Camus. Never mention rats again. Nice. Okay. There are also a number of rare breeds of sump spider. Ugh, also not good. Come on, we should get back to work. If I get a bonus tonight, nice. maybe I can buy a picture or a mirror or something. I mean, I do love this though, the style. Um, ooh, we can buy stuff. Huh. Driver 14FC, this is Control. Come in. We need you to deliver a package to the Sin Wave oh, nightclub. It. You're going to have to deliver in person to the rooftop. That's where you can access the VIP area. So I just go to the door and... <laughs> Not gonna lie to you, kid. This one is gonna be tricky, but I think you can do it. The club's picky about who gets in. Have you heard of Lomo? No. He's the owner of the club. And most of this sector, too. He's got a piece of every business in the Undertown. And he didn't get them by asking nicely. Be careful about him. I will. Are they expecting me? Sure. I'm just letting you know you might come up against some resistance. These are powerful people, so watch what you say. Powerful people? Let's just say they're very private clients who have reason to suspect any strangers might be undercover corpsec. You'll have to convince them otherwise. Understood. And 14 FC? Yeah? This has been a tough night for the company. We're understaffed and overworked, and we keep losing contact with drivers. There's something in the air tonight. Be careful. And if you do a good job on this delivery, all past infractions are forgiven. Ooh, Understood. Nice. Understood. It's a good opportunity to, uh, to continue nice. our job. I'm buying a lot of stuff, by the way, but I'm not sure if it's needed. Oh, it's definitely needed. Look how beautiful. We got a little fridge, we got a little dog house for Camus, even though he doesn't have a body yet, but we will get there. And we do have a radio that doesn't work. Oh my god, I love it. I think I will end it here. We made some good progress. We got an infraction because we dropped a bomb in a chute. We helped a um, human consuming elevator. Uh, we dropped off a hat in a box. <laughs> I mean... 
it sounds like some really fucked up game to be honest, but I mean, I love it. I love it. Um, so yeah, thank you guys for joining me on this one. We will continue very soon, very soon. Um, and I'm very curious if we will actually one day be able to get a body for a dog because I really, really want that. I hope we can buy it. That would be brilliant. But yeah, thank you guys for watching. Thank you for joining me and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.